It's like, no shit, lady. No shit. Nah, stay on her. Definitely no good. Not all the shit they keep doing to it. Let's show him the sibling combination. Oh, you idiot, I've always got your back. Yeah, where did it come from? Space, but where's it going? Earth. No good. Better just stay in space. When space goes to space, you're fine. When space comes to Earth, it kills everyone, like you say. So definitely get out of Earth. So I want to, I want to do the, the no guard attack because the no guard attack is good. Tejinomeを引きつければいいんだな。重装具と圧倒的な攻撃力、資格はなしか。Oh, they're all getting naked for the no guard attack. You can't fucking defend against rock, paper, and scissors. You lose. You lose. How you get Gurren Lagann in those dimensions? Because he punches the holes from the dimension it's in till he's there. It doesn't, it doesn't have its... This thing that attacks a garbage is a gun and missiles. It gets much cooler attacks later. They need to get naked to do it because then they're exposing everything. They're bearing it all. They're not caring about defense. But also, Fudo's weird. And also, I'm pretty sure that when they did that attack, that was when Jin shot them with the the missiles. Yeah, special missiles that were meant to pass through because they were like, we got to catch that robot, it's really good. We shoot missiles that kill the pilot. But it turned out they hadn't calibrated it properly, so all it did was tear their clothes. And then they were like, let's fucking do it, all the clothes off, let's go. Wow, yeah, boom, got him. We do this reach. Clothes do inhibit um, uh, Zeska's powers. Zeska has impact power and... Uh, like super sensory perception and that's why she's always half naked definitely not because someone on the board wanted to draw naked girls all the time I just need these two dudes I need this guy to have another turn so he can attack Marido's Banaji. Angelo, I sort of hate you the most. Yeah, you do support yourself. Yeah, all right, sure.
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> think of boobs and weed is all that good. So yeah, he's, he's perfect. Let's find a picture of Zesco so you can see her outfit. Zesco won. Oh good, it's gonna have problems because I'm looking up Zeska. That's Zeska's outfit. That's her after getting shot by the the clothes destroying missile. So you feel like she's an extra, just the person who's learning how to run? Yeah, pretty much. She has more clothes. Yeah, cause, well, that's because she wears a full pilot suit when they're in the thing, so they don't die. Impossible! I was beaten! How could the fortified human beat me? Die in X Blue, Z Blue, I'll get you next time, fuckers. Haha, <laughs> Angelo. Pure garbage, as expected. Let's go, nerds. Uh, I'm tempted to have C2 in front. Mm, nah, like she definitely doesn't, doesn't do more damage than that dude in the front. And she does way more in the back than that dude. Mm. Let's see if I can find a picture of the Aquarian Evil. お前たちは指導者に踊らされた兵士だ。車線は通っている。There's uh, Amata and Mikono and Zeska in their piloting suits. They're about to do the no guard attack, but they're talking to Amata and they appear as little ghosts in the cockpit when they talk to each other rather than on a little TV screen because uh, anime. It feels like you're right in here with me. Buh. It just the oh, it's 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 projections of their aura or whatever. That's how you know that they're all in sync. Is that instead of having to show up on the little TV screen, they can appear right there and they feel like they're right next to you in the machine. You got when they combine, they all feel like they're having an orgasm as well. It's, it's not subtle. <laughs> Why is they looking away from him? Who knows? They're just being weird, isn't they? She don't want to look at him because they're being weird. He's probably like, oh, I don't want to ruin Makona's. Uh, the Zeska's a good bit is that she really likes Samada, but she doesn't like hate Makono for it. She like she's obviously jealous for it, but she's never like, damn, fuck you, girl. She's just like, damn, you know what? It's fine. It's good. Mm. I'm gonna 
blow up a boat. I'll blow up the boat that's more hurt first. Bam, bam, bam. Wow, 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 wow. ガーダン。Nice work, Shinji. You learned the accelerate spell. Very nice. Very good. Gotta avoid the cockpit, gotta avoid the cockpit. The boat, Shinji. It's called a bridge when it's a boat. Curse you, Federation ship man! It's like, did you mention me? He's not a Federation ship man. Okay, who do I want to fight? Who? I want. I want Banaji versus Marida, so I can block everybody but her. Don't fuck it up, boss. Beat down by me, the good boy. Boss ever let me down? Constantly. Actually, no, the boss could never let me down because I was expected to lose to him. He can only meet my expectations or pleasantly surprise me. Bam, 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 bam. I like that, Junior. Piece of shit. Oh, this damage is pretty bad. What figure I am I on? This boy? This boy's pretty good.
I think it's one point eight. Oh, that joke up. Duh, you'll see Zebu. I'll be a good boy. Hold up. Yeah, let's go, Banaji. All right. And then Bright's like, hold up, what are you doing? He's like, I've got to find out. I've got to find out what he knows about Quattro. It's like, C Camille, hold it. Camille and Anne, you have fallen for our sick trap by pursuing your vendetta with me instead of protecting the boy. Camille. Don't. Yoink. Fucking got him. Banaji. The unconscious. Uh, in the show, it's um, Merida. Merida just fucking punches his robot in the stomach and he vomits and passes out. You fucked it, Camille. You shirked your duty because you were mad as hell. Mobile suit pilot is trash. You see, you Joker. Nice work, you know. The Banaji. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> Canoe does dumb thing because he's mad. He's eleven. U G. Oh, jeez, these jokers are back up again. What a time. Oh, great. Fight U G. Banaji. I fucked it. I'm sorry. Actually, I didn't even look up what the SR point was. If it's taken all out on the same turn, then um, I'm going to be upset. Oh, yeah, it is. Um... Okay, well, it says I haven't... Okay, so I've taken out Gunier, I've taken out Kess, and I took out Angelo. Did I do that all this turn? Yeah, I did it that with that guy this turn. I did Gunier this turn. I haven't taken out Kess yet. And do I have to take out Merida? Yeah, I do. All right. Honorable four turn four. Well, I gotta do it now. So I guess we won't see um, what Banaji says to Merida because he's fucking gone anyway. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, Banaji says to Merida. Uh, he goes, "It's that mech with the four wings again." And then Merida then says internally, "Now that I think about it, everything was set in motion after that battle with this white MS. Then I'll end it all right here. And for the sake of my master, I'll rescue Lady Minerva." But now nah, I gotta blow her up. Yeah, um, between two and three, um, Mbips is good because much more than that, and like the Twitch thing just actually cannot handle it. Who actually pilots the shuttle? I believe... Um, Umemaro handles the steering. The old man, Mr. Kakukoji. He handles the steering. But... They do, like, fire the missile, and then sometimes Ikue is like, uh, which one's the missile button? Uh, that one. Yeah, got it. But it might be, um... Tetsuo. The wrench man. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I got enough to install stuff like this. Mm. Okay, yeah, I gotta go again, so I do. Block the Kester. You alright, Kess? Yeah, I'm fine, Marina. It's good. I'll just leave. Just leave. Hathaway launches into Jigan. It's like, who's in that Jigan? Huh? It's Hathaway! Kess! Oh, it's my boss. Why are you getting so friendly? Like, come back, guess. Neo Z on her bad. Hathaway, come on, show us a fucking dick, dude. No, Hathaway, he understands me. You're just a child and you're bad. Duh, guess. Get the fuck back here right now, my shitty child. Camille, back up, Hathaway. Uh, Alright. Guess. Guess. Duh, Quattro. Is he really coming back to being sharp for real? Yeah, I've got Kiriko, Koji, Simon, and Aoi is also there to walk one bed. She's got a lot of hit points, she's got 35,000 hit points. Oh, it's gone. I should have moved them one step away so you could support with the missile launcher. This is fine. Excellent. Double uh, boomerang. Giga drill, why not, right? Yeah, everyone's just like, Ugh. I hate all of this. This place is why don't you stop being jerks? My enemy. Kill you. The module, excellent. Got our SR point. <laughs> Miss Midver, I will rest you. Uh, Marida Cruz, retreating. Sorry, Marida, but I'm sticking with this one. Gotta see what Shah's up to.
parody. Don't let me down. Dude. You did you kill the beast. He just let the big yell. Well, regular yell, but you can do it big. I'm guessing she, yeah, I think she got the bomb. I think he's just like, I just yelled at someone really loud to go back. Pretty much. He just goes, we're going in. <laughs> Off they go. I forgot that the Love Master was still here. <laughs> Fucking K. Can't believe he didn't want to fuck a space girl with covered in eyes. It's fucked up, K. Or the one with the nose hole that's up to 10 centimeters. <laughs> Disgusting, Kay. You said you want to fuck all the women, but it seems to me that actually you're quite racist. And I'm pretty sure that he only fell in love hard with Mimsy because she was like, yeah, our species just becomes fucking barren at the age of 18. He's like, hell yeah, dude, let's go. And then she had a some tentacle come out of her back and he's like, hell yeah, let's go. I mean... I'm sure he's alright to frogs and shit. Yeah, here's a picture over there, then it goes out. August is good, August too, you know, good, don't watch that. That's bad. And 
actually... They are like humans. The Aman. Because all gets, they all get fucked up because of Kay's bomb, so there's just like... People from 300 years in the future living people from 3,000 years in the future. <laughs> Probably an acceptable tentacle to hot bay ratio. Yeah? I mean, I'm sure Kay would mind if there were some more tentacles, but... He's fine with that. Hathaway, you just fuck it like Hathaway's garbage. He's super bad. And I think his ace bonus doesn't even work because it's like changes spell into something else. Yeah, he changes hot blood into love and he doesn't have either of those yet. But he's got gain and guts, right? Effort and guts, effort and guts. Too bad he's pissed. Also, I don't like that AG's got a cat catalogue of dimensional babes. Or do I like that? Listen, if Hathaway didn't want me to bully him, he should have been good. I will never deploy that boy except for the one time, like the times it's required for the secrets. Jimmy from Mo. He's trying, I'll say he's trying. It's okay, I think his dad's about to give him a fucking slap. Punch him across the room. is done. Duh, and they stole the unicorn and Camille is very upset. Hathaway! Yep, yeah, just slapped his son. What, what would your mother and Chamin say if you fucking died out there? Just because you spent a little time in the simulator doesn't mean you're good. And then Amara's like, you were chasing Kess, right, Hathaway? Yeah, I'm gonna get Kess back. And Amara's like, you're not, dude. Shari's gonna, like, use and abuse her excessive empathic abilities for all she's worth, right? Like, just... You ain't getting her back. Shar's bad. And then Hathaway's like, no, I'm not gonna give up. So Katz comes over and he's like, uh, Bright, Bright, Captain Bright, uh, I'll, I'll make sure he keeps you on beef. Katz is like, I'll protect him, I'll make sure he doesn't die. Uh, all right then. Don't tell your mother about this. And then uh, Cat says that he's got a little bit of experience in chasing girls that are infatuated with older men, and it always ends badly. And you'd rather not see Hathaway go through what he had to do. Couldn't get Cat away from Shara or whatever. And now it's up to Amaro and Shin to talk to Camille. Um, uh, Shin is mad as hell. Um, uh, yeah, he says that he sees in Camille the same kind of uh, fear that made him uh, subject other people on, do on the Durandal, uh, tell him what was right and wrong. And it was Camille who snapped him out of that back then, so why the hell is Camille so afraid of Shah's shadow now? And Kill's like, damn dude, I get it. I get it, thanks. That's a good art coming portrait. It's like, you got it, dude. You're not gonna make the same mistake again, right? They're gonna go get Banaji, and apparently, um 
Is this where Naguza comes over? Yeah, there's Naguza. Naguza's like, I know, I know where Vinaji uh, might have been hauled off to. It's been taken to Palau, so... Yeah, part of Side 6 is a mining colony, like a big mining base, so let's do it. And Kimo's like, I'm gonna do that. Let's go get that boy back.